Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome back to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming. Thank you so much for joining me today in Craft the World. We got a lot we need to get to today. Thank you for coming out and watching the last episode. If you haven't seen it, it should be popping up right now on your screen. You can go check that out. We uh, were digging down, and we found our big friend down here who we are not going to go fight. And then there was that big worm that was down here. We almost killed it, but it escaped, and it's kind of dug this way. And you can see all that green slime. Eventually, we'll have to chase that down and get rid of that. Looks like our dwarves are under... Oh, it's a mite. Uh, looks like we are doing well there. All right, we're just getting some resources out of here as well. We'll go ahead and put some more ladders up. Oop, there's some water there with a slug in it, so we'll have to see what's going on there. Got about a minute and 10 seconds. A minute, there we go, uh, till our next attack. So we'll go ahead and get ready to hunker down there. In this episode, I would like to go ahead and improve our house, improve our, our dwarves' houses. You can see we got a lot of dirt still in here, some rock and a lot of dirt over here and here. Just want to go ahead and fix that up for them so they don't feel like they're living in such a uh, crap shack, for lack of a better term. Let's go ahead and get all of our dwarves back into the shelter here. We're going to set them on to combat. And then we got three seconds until the next wave comes and the portal is open. And looks like they're going to be coming from our right. We've got some flying goblins. Let's go ahead and trigger the attack. Uh, we'll go ahead and unlock them. Here they come. All right, there we go. Our wizard zapping them. The archer's shooting at them. We got our, our mace bearers out here. Got a big skeleton coming this way. Looks like we're going to get rid of all the flying troops. Let's go ahead and get them in combat. Take down all these guys before they get anywhere close. No one's hurt yet. Yep, we're under attack. I see a lot of green hearts going away. Some of our red hearts are getting smaller, but that's okay. He's healing up. Low health. Let's go ahead and heal you up, my friend. Let's go to equipped here. And we're going to get you healed back up. Oops, we're going to need to make some more bandages here soon. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and go into craft here, and I think bandages, where were bandages at? Um, let's see if we can find them here. All right, you guys are gonna have to forgive me as I click around. Uh, all right, bandages, bandages, here you are. What do we need? Leaves, water, and resin. Let's go ahead and make 50 of them. All right, we're gonna make 50. And let's go back into equipped. We'll make sure we get everyone healed up, used to max. Use to max. All right. And yep, use. Okay. You need some. Yeah, you're good. Use to max. We're good there. Owen needs some. Use to max. Elena's good. Lisbeth. All right. So we're back healed up. We're doing a pretty good dent into that portal. Let's go ahead and trigger this big guy to be attacked. And we still got. Don't know how he made it up there, but he's up there. All right. He's already lost a heart. Going down onto his last heart. All right, my dwarves. The Kingdom of Earthbringers is kicking butt and taking names. Exactly what they need to do. Let's go ahead and trigger everyone on these guys. And they're going to take out that last skeleton. And then we got a zombie. And then I don't want to kill the Goblin uh, King here. Because last time we did that, they attacked in the flying wyvern dragon thing. And it looks like we survived. So we're going to go back to balanced here. Let's see. Um, oh, we got a zombie down here. We'll trigger him to be attacked. See if we got anyone else sneak around. I don't see anyone. All right. Kingdom of Earthbingers kicking butt, taking names. Fantastic. I'm very happy for our group. I don't know what that guy's doing up there, but we'll trigger him to be attacked. Um, I guess we're attacking the Goblin King. Didn't want to do that, but that's okay. We'll go ahead and have them destroy the camp as well. Some rain coming down. Oh, that guy got triggered up there, but they're going to take care of him pretty quickly. And he is gone just like that. And he's got a rune. Eventually, we'll use that for our portal. They're going to destroy that camp. I can't get through. Oh, they're trying to retrieve whatever that is. You stubborn, aren't you? Look out. Yeah, I know. We killed you again. Sounds like we'll have friends coming our way eventually, but that's okay. We will survive just like we survived the last time. All right, they're bringing all those resources in. So while they're doing that, let's see what we want to upgrade our house to. Um, I could do wooden walls. Do we have anything else? No, I think it's just going to be wooden walls. So let's just go ahead and make quite a few wooden walls. Uh, yeah, we'll make 60 more. All right. Oops. Um, okay, we have our dragon friend coming back in. We're going to switch everyone back to combat. Um, come on, guys. Fire. I know you guys need to put that fire out. Um, how do I extinguish? Extinguish. Let me open, um, open that up. Let's see if we can get up there. All right. 
we're getting something going here. Our archer is going to fall. That's not going to do us any good. Yeah, he needs to come down. He's setting our door on fire again. Extinguish. I don't know. That archer is just <laughs> running laps. It's all right. He's already down a heart. Um, archer, I would really like for you to come outside and shoot. That would make much more sense. Our owl cat is joining combat too. Uh, everyone's set to combat and they're all just, just hanging out. We'll go ahead and start extinguishing some of these flames here. Extinguish, extinguish, extinguish. Where's all of our other doors at? Oh, they're sleeping from combat. Okay. All right, well, let's go back up here. We're almost done with the wyvern. Our owl cat is kicking butt and taking names. Extinguish these two, please. Oh, did I close the door? I closed it. That's probably why they couldn't come outside. All right. He's almost gone. And there he goes. Down he goes. Now we got to kill... Uh, oh, we got some paratroopers coming in. All right, let's trigger the attack there. And we're going to go to equip and make sure everyone's healed up again. Man, this has just been another episode full of combat. So if that's what you were looking for, that's what you got. Heal up glue here. Sigrid, let's get you healed up. All right, Sana's doing good. Daver, you need some health. Still got 11 dwarves. No one's died, so that's good. Fubar. Get you healed back up. Owen's doing good. Lisbeth and Nan need some. Go ahead and use that. Nan, let's get you back up to max health. And all right, back into combat. Looks like our pets are taking care of the paratroopers on the roof. And we are, dwarves are down here taking care of these guys. Their health is not going down very quickly. That is not good. Hopefully it's just we need more guys up here fighting. Um, they took care of one or two on the roof. A couple more going down here. All right, let's, uh, all right, we're getting rid of him. They're up there. They're starting to come in. All right, that one's going down. Perfect. All right, we're, we're in good shape. One last, this is the goblin chief. That's why his health isn't going down very quick. All right, let's get these guys taken care of as well on there. All the little enemies are cleared. All right, so he's down. Good. He looks like he brought us something. Great. All right, let's go back to balanced again. That was a heck of attack. We took care of the portal and we took care of the goblin and he brought us a bunch of goodies. We'll collect all that up here in a second. All right, and now that that's done, we can go ahead and start replacing all of the dirt here because I want to make this the nice house for our dwarves that they deserve. So they'll start replacing all that. Replace, 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 replace. See, there we go. That looks much better. I could replace it on that back wall too. Let's go ahead and um, not do what I just did. And we'll do that. Now, can I click on the back wall? It's not letting me click on that back wall. Um, let's see here. Can I right click it? No. All right. So I guess that's just the way it is. So let's go rear stone, replace that. Replace rear stone, replace rear stone. Uh, replace earth. Let's see if they can get to it from here. Replace rear earth. And then we're going to do replace stone, replace stone, replace stone, replace roots. Okay. I think that that's looking pretty good. I like that. And we'll just go ahead and replace earth and, yeah, let's do replace earth. That is, let's switch that to that. And we're just going to make this a giant old block. There we go. Perfect. All right. So they can't get to that. I can live with that. And I keep clicking that thinking I can do something different, but that's okay. So let's just go ahead and do replace rear earth. We'll change that out. This is looking like a little bit better of a house for them. Just a little bit better. So we'll go ahead and... Uh, replace earth. All right, we're just gonna start clicking all the way back here and we're doing good on earth tile or excuse me doing good on wood tiles replace earth Replace earth Man, you guys are just gonna see me click this a lot. All right Well, maybe I'll do that off screen, but you guys get the idea. This is gonna start looking a lot better Hopefully that comfort starts to go up. We're at 63 comfort. I can I can live with that Replace earth there. All right, so we'll leave that at that. Actually. I think we can no. Let's just switch this like that, there we go, perfect. All right, that got replaced. Replace stone. All right, replace earth, replace earth. Anyways, I'll come back and change all that up when you guys don't have to see me clicking, but you get the idea, it's starting to look a lot better. Got some bushes we go ahead and collect up for our doors. We'll get that bush, bush too. All right, how are we doing down here? Uh, we worked our way up here. There's an underground cave. I'd kind of like to see what it looks like. Zoom out. Okay, so let's go ahead and we're going to clear out this spider. 
and that snail, and we'll get that iron ore. This needs to be cleared out, and we'll go ahead and drop down a torch. Oh, we can't do that, so once that gets cleared out, we can do that. All right, they're all gonna run in here, clean this up for us, start getting rid of all this stuff. All right, perfect. So let's go ahead and drop a torch in right there. We'll mine that out, we'll mine that out. We'll put dirt back in there, and then we'll ladder up, and then we'll just, I guess that water's gonna drain down, huh? Um, okay, so let's put some dirt there. We'll mine that out, mine that out. And then maybe we just move the ladder over one? Yeah, that's what we'll do. It'll be a little, little funky, but that's okay. We'll do that there, do that there, all right. Ladder, ladder, and then we'll cross over, and then let's bring this up and get into this cavern and see what this cavern has to offer for us. I know you guys can't get that down there. That's okay. You can leave it. Uh, we'll eventually need to start mining out all this silver. So what we could do is mine this out and then move that dirt over. We'd have to move that up. You guys can take care of that, please. There we go. Nope, don't mine that out. That dirt can be mined out. Perfect. And we'll go right there. And then we'll go there. Can they not do that? Or are they just waiting on someone to bring it down? I would assume they could do that. I don't know. Hmm. All right. Oh, they already cleaned this out and there's already trees regrowing. So let's go ahead and do all that. And then, yeah, I know I can't get through. I can't get through. We might have to move this ladder over and maybe put the torch there. They seem to be making it through. Is there anyone coming down off a ladder? Yeah. Okay. There we go. Perfect. All right. So while that's happening, let's go ahead and clear out some of the silver. Mark that. We'll get some more coal there. Perfect. Um, I want to get up to this iron, so we'll go ahead and build a ladder there and mark that, and then we'll get in here, and we'll probably just leave those there for now, those uh, piranha plants. They're not doing any no harm to us. All right, that coal's getting mined out. Silver's getting mined out. Perfect. We'll go ahead and put some dirt back into there. Now, can I switch? Replace silver ore. Perfect. And that's what we'll do. Replace silver ore, and then we'll put some dirt there. Put a little dirt there. Nope, we're gonna replace silver ore. All right, that'll be a good start for us. They'll collect all those resources, fantastic. How are we doing up here? Great, we'll do that, we'll do that, and then that should get us into this little cavern and we'll see what's going on up there. Great news. All right, getting that mined out. Let's go ahead and mine that coal out as well. They got that iron ore, perfect. Let's go ahead and do that and then we'll do just for funsies, a piece of dirt there, and I'll drop a torch there, just so we got plenty of light up here. Perfect. We're gonna drop a torch there. Oh, man, that I can't get through is getting a little annoying, but that's okay. That is okay. All right, we got that. Let's go ahead and clean that up. Um, I wonder if I should just get, yeah, you know what? Let's just, let's just do this. And then we'll just have a nice level path all the way through. We'll drop our ladder down. We'll take care of those crystals here. Because eventually I'm just going to keep dropping this ladder straight down. We'll have one main highway from the tippy tippy top all the way to the bottom. Unless that's a bad idea. Let me know down in the comments if that's a, a bad idea what I'm going for. Looks like we got a book here. We'll go ahead and get that Fisher's book. Fantastic. They're mining out the last of that dirt. Um, we'll just go ahead and drop some dirt in there. That needs to be mined. Perfect. All right. So we'll just have a nice easy path right across like that. Under attack from where? Oh, we got some zombies coming in. All right, let's switch everyone over to attack. Get everyone in here. I don't know why that archer has to run right up there. There you go. You just need to stand like two or three squares back, bud. Keep you out of a lot of damage. All right, they're taking care of those big guys. Down they go. Perfect. All right, do we got anything coming from our right side? No, but we got a really big tree there. Got one guy coming. We'll go ahead and mark him to be taken out. And then we got quite a bit coming this way. So we'll go ahead and get everyone working to the right now clean up this attack before it can get anywhere near us got some of the big zombie skeletons working their way and they're just gonna blow by everyone huh I guess that that works I was hoping you'd just attack the guys as you worked over but that's okay they're taking care of the zombie and then they'll start combating these skeletons low health who's got low health Lisbeth okay let's go ahead go to equipped here yeah you got pretty low health used to maximum perfect and you're now healed up and ready to go all right, let's go ahead and go back to balance, get everyone working again here. Uh, for some reason, we took a piece of dirt out there. I don't remember clicking that, but I could be wrong. I mean, I'm wrong a lot, so go ahead and put that dirt back in. Perfect. All right, that's taken care of. That's taken care of. 
How are we looking down here? We got some resources down here. We'll go ahead and get these. And then, all right, we're doing good. How are we doing up here? Okay, we made our way in. So let's go ahead and clear that out. We'll clear that out. Drop a torch in there to get a little light and let's see what this cavern looks like. I'm, I'm excited to see what's up here. Gotta be careful, I don't wanna to get too close to our friend. Maybe we'll take care of him here in a few minutes towards the end of the episode. I, he's kinda of in a weird spot. I, I wanna, hmm. Should we just like drop down here and come across this way maybe? I don't know, let's go ahead and have them dig out to this wooden structure and then we'll go ahead and build our ladder all the way in there. And we'll need some more ladders here. So let's just go ahead and make 10, and we'll make 20 more ladders, there we go. All right, we got plenty of ladders to keep working our way down. King of Earth King bringers, kicking butt, taking names, collecting all these resources for us. All right, let's see, let's go ahead and mark some more things to be fished. And then what do we got food-wise? We got enough food on the tables. Let's back out for a second. Ooh, those tables are empty. Let's get some food out there for them. All right, we got plenty of fish stew. We'll just load up a table of fish stew. Then we'll put some steaks out. Then we'll put some salads out. So they got a little bit of everything to choose from and keep themselves nice and full and healed. All right, they're digging down there. Perfect. We'll just go ahead and put those ladders in. And then I'm gonna have them go ahead and dig out those four and then we'll drop a torch here and here. All right, oh, uh-oh, 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 there's that worm. Go, 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 attack, attack, attack. Why can't I click on it to be attacked? Um, there we go, now it's on attack. Everyone come in. All right, prepare for battle, it's full health. We might be going, yep, we're, hmm, this is not good. Okay, um, attack this guy too. He is really whooping on us. Um, and we got a skeleton here, we got, Got a, quite a lot going on here. Okay, this is not good. This is not good at all. Let's go back here to heal everyone up. Use to maximum. Use to maximum. He's good. Use to maximum. Use to maximum. This is not how I wanted it to go, but we'll we'll make do. Let's switch over to craft here. And where was where was the healing stuff? Was it under here? Here it is. All right. Let's make let's make like. 20, okay, we ran out of water, so I guess that's that's all we get. Um, everyone's on combat. Hopefully no one dies here. This is gonna get ugly here, boys and girls. Um, there's a, a beholder in there. Um, mm, not good, not good at all. And that rock is back in. Let's just go ahead and dig that out. Someone just died, that's, uh, two people just died. Um, all right, let's cancel that. Well, that's not what, um, and you're just going to die too. Ugh. That's not really what I wanted to happen. Um, but that, that is what it is. That, that, that is what it is. Um, okay. So we just lost two or three dwarves. Uh, let's go ahead and get off combat. We'll go back to balanced here. Um, hmm. let's just go ahead and put some dirt in here and cover that up. That way we're not getting in there and falling in with that worm again. Cause that worm, uh, not what I wanted to happen, but that's okay. That's okay. We learned from it. We'll get some doors respawning here, 30 seconds or so, and we'll just re-equip them and we'll move on and we survived. Okay. Dug down deep enough. Great. All right. We'll put that there. They're mining that out and we're just, we're just gonna, oh, he's coming back up this way. Um, all right. Well, let's see which, if he turns right, we'll go after him because I'm not in the mood to have all our dwarves fall down again. Yep, gained one population. Another one respawning in about two minutes. That's okay. And we'll go ahead and put a torch here while we're waiting. All right, and uh, no, let's turn that off because you're gonna fall down. That is not, oh, they're going for him. Um, turn that off, get out, get out, run. Not what I wanted, not what I wanted at all. All right, uh, we do not, let's just go. Yeah, gather resources. Don't even go to attacking. Okay, that worm has turned that off again, so he has left it. We won't have to worry about that. All right, let's go. Let's just go back to balanced here. All right, we'll mine that out. Put that there. There's a door there. Or is that a portal? I don't know. A lot of resources. An axe. Some more resources down there. Well, let's not go down there yet. Let's just leave that the way that is. And we'll go ahead and close these holes up. Close that up. Go ahead and replace that coal there. They're mining that out. Fantastic. Some rats down here chewing on that wood, I guess. 
All right, so he just spawned. Looks like we're going to need to give him his stuff back. A lot of stuff piled down there, huh? A lot of stuff. All right, so let's go to equipped here. All right, prog or pog. We're going to give you a stone axe and then a stone pickaxe and then a steel club. I can give you some iron boots and that looks like that's about it. You are a warrior, so we're going to give you the warrior's book. Get you a little higher up. Do we have anyone else we need to equip? All right, roll. Same thing, stone axe. Um, we'll give him the goblin spear as his weapon. And then a stone axe there. And Okay, so that's everyone. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. So that's kind of closed up here. And we can go ahead and put some dirt there. All right, and that's been closed up. Where's my torches at? We'll put a torch there. Ugh, not a great episode, but we're doing okay. We are doing okay. Do we have any attacks coming? We got a zombie over here. Let's get rid of him. Got a lot of water flowing into our base. All right, anyone coming from over here? No. All right, they took care of that zombie. And we do need to get some water. So let's go ahead and gather a bunch of water. Gather water. Gather water. Gather water. Let's clean up some of this water here. And we're going to go ahead and close our roof so it's not raining down into our mine. Let's see, have a big puddle. Yeah, we got a big puddle down here. That's okay. It can stay down there. Ah, that worm. That worm is doing us nasty. But that's okay. That's okay. As long as he stays out of our way and doesn't bring any more of our dwarves to their death. Looks like everyone's respawned. So let's go back to equipped here. All right. Far? Far? I don't know. He's a miner. So we'll go... Stone pickaxe, a regular old axe, and then let's give him a steel club. And then can I give him anything for mining? Cook, carpenter, mage, smithing apron. I could give him a hat, but he already has a hat. Uh, let's go back to crafting here and see if we can upgrade some of these weapons or some of these tools. All right, let's go. Scissors aren't going to do us no good. Go ahead and make a couple iron pickaxes. We'll go ahead and upgrade some iron pickaxes there. All right, they got some water. We can cancel out all that. Let's go ahead and collect all this wood. Um, I don't know why they're not just jumping down there and getting that water. They should be able to. Yeah, just like that. They should be able to jump down and get water. All right, that's all being collected. Perfect, perfect. Let's get all this. All right, well, we survived. We didn't do much damage, but we survived our... First encounter with uh, Mr. Scary here, but that's that's okay. This worm's doing its thing over here. It can do all at once over there. All right, got that down there to the beholder. Man, I kind of want to just drop in right here because there's almost like two caverns, right? Looks like there's a cavern over here to the right, and then this with the rats and the beholder. I wonder if the beholder is any strong. Looks like there's ooh something shiny over here. Man, we really need to get our dwarves a lot strong. All right, let's go after this guy. He has caused us enough issues. We're putting everyone on attack, and we're taking this guy out. I'm not. We're not dealing with him. We'll put our ladder up there. Hopefully, we can get to him. Are they even coming down? Okay, they are starting to come down. Good. All right. Let's see if because they're all melee. Or are they just bringing the ladders? They're bringing the ladders. The archer should be able to get to him, or the mage. Yeah, get him, mage. Zap him. Zap him really good. <laughs> okay. Um, we could mine across. No, we're just going to let them go. We're going to let them go. It's not worth it. We're, we're going to go back to balanced, and they're going to do their thing. And we'll just, we'll just start putting some dirt in where we need to put dirt. Let's fill in some of these holes here. We can put something there, and we should be able to hit those three from there. All right, where's he going? Is he going straight up, though? Yeah, he can go straight up. Whatever. I don't care. He can do his thing. Get some of those crystals here. Clean up some of this. Perfect. Well, hmm, man, I don't know. That was that was something. I, I'm glad we survived, but kind of angry. Maybe we go in here next and take out this beholder. It's only one guy. I don't know how he spawned all this stuff, but he spawned a couple zombies and a couple skeletons that did us in dirty. Did us in dirty, but that's okay. We survived. So I think that's where we're going to go ahead and end it. Um, thank you for coming out and watching some Tooth and Scrubs Gaming here in Craft the World. If you've enjoyed the video, go ahead and like it. Comment on down below, really on anything. Still looking on feedback on how to get better as a commentator, gameplay, 
anything you guys want to let me know, please, 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 the more you tell me, the better I can get so I can make better videos for you. So let me know in the comments because that's how I will get better. Lastly, if you want to see more content like this, don't forget to subscribe to Tooth and Scrubs Gaming so you get all the great content on time and in an orderly fashion. You can see the train wreck that this channel is. Uh, that I am. So, you know, it's kind of fun to see people failing in life, right? Um, so thank you so much, and we'll see you in the next Craft the World video.